Hello and welcome back to another episode of Europe Universalis 4 as we continue our game with Divet. Uh, we lost the war. Uh, I know, I know, it's a bummer, but well, we lost against the biggest baddest uh, in the block, which is France. And now we border France. Ain't that lovely. Well, we actually do not border France yet, but we will as soon as we integrate Orissa, which is right here. This is hostile siege. Uh, we will integrate Oresa, uh, finally. It's been long, long, long overdue. And in the meantime, we're going to continue to chip out at Ming and Shun and maybe even Tibet. Let's get this going already. Oh yeah, by the way, one army around here. Kind of forgot that there was an army there. Good thing about integrating Orissa is that we will be able to get um, we will be able to get uh, more troops to fight off France against. Uh, these guys are not Western; they are still Indian, so their units are uh, Indian tech group. We already have Western unit tech, so that will make a difference and if you see here their techno military level is 19 that's why we were losing all those battles and we are winning battles against France because well military level of them is 17 and ours is 28 well 27 28 we have one ahead of we are one ahead of them and we will take this as soon as possible because I want to get the well the good the good infantry and the last line of flying bat the last line of artillery which is the flying battery we are only fabricating claims on Gangzhou and then we'll declare war uh, against someone diplomacy yeah improve relations improve relations don't want them to make declare war upon me again that would be really really bad in the meantime we lost tons of manpower as you can see here we are gaining a th well a thousand three hundred and twenty each month it's not terrific but it's better than nothing we can check up apparently I'm not sure if I will though well let's we are getting minus twenty percent so might as well take advantage of it might as well take advantage of it and by the way who is France fighting Ottomans, Ragusa, Ferrara, Sweden and Einaut and they are losing oh that's lovely we'll probably should join the coalition against France if there is any there isn't huh how about that France is this big and it doesn't have a coalition formed against them. I would like to say that's interesting, but that's something I do not like. Lose stability. Sure, let's lose a bit of stability. Time to shake up things a little bit. Are they converting this? No, that is Hindu Buddhist. Hindu. Yeah, they are not. Another general died. How oh, lovely. Tibet left a coalition against us. Do we still have any coalition against us, by the way? Your country. No, we don't. Alright, so 7074. 1774. We'll, we will integrate them. That's good news. Good thing we started the integration. Competing great power. Yeah. Defender of territory. Merchant standing down. Conquered real province. Yeah, yeah, yada, yada, yada. Shun. Um, target of the coalition of Orat Ord. How long until that is done? Pretty soon, I guess. Alright, conquest against Ming, lovely, let's pause. 
because we are going to fabricate another claim. I'm not going to royal marriage you. Covert. No, 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 no. Covert action. Fabricate claim. Now let's see. Uh, sure. Chunk wing. We'll do that one. Probably do this one as well. And then we'll start to fabricate claims over here. They have Buddhist provinces, so that's good. <coughs> and we will take up in military technology. It will cost a ton. A ton, really a ton. But, well, we are getting eight. Are we still converging, by the way? No, we are not, so cancel this. Hanyang. Cancel. Hanyang, Hanyang. And yeah. It's this one. Do we need to boost the stability? Probably. Revolt in Shishuan. Oh, and those guys are there. Ugh. Oh. Convert missionaries. Non accepted culture, provincial take tax income. Really? Five percent, it's there, three percent, one. Just for a little bit. Uh them just for one percent, I think. I think with this stability it will increase Stability 2. Missionary strength plus 0 0.5. If I boost it, missionary strength plus 1%. It still won't be done, will it? February 18th, then. God dang it. And now it's blocked because. 0 0.02. Something along those lines. Ugh. And we have a level 3 advisor here. Hmm, damn it. Right, let's take this. And let's switch this. We'll go for impulse ca infantry, for inland cavalry, and for flying batteries. There. Manpower, that's lovely. Right, let's 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 what? Yeah, let's take this guy. What the hell? Won't be able to convert these anyway, so at least not for now. You can dock. Actually, you can go there. Hmm. This is getting a bit slow. I'm really worried. Alright, let's take this. Slowing uh, the heck. It's really, really, really slowing down. Three military leaders, though. We have two. By the way, friends, 27 still, and they are hostile towards us. They are losing the battle. Allied with a ton, a heck ton of guys. Establish friends in the spy islands. This is not good because they will get apparently cast a spell against us, maybe. Actually no they didn't. Huh. 
Interesting. Good thing is, if they invade us uh, over here, as Divet, you really want to fight defensive wars. I'll explain. I'll explain why. I think I've already explained a couple of times, but I explain it. I will explain it again. You have one thing right here that is attrition for enemies plus one. If you take defensive ideas, you'll get attrition for enemies plus one. And by the fact that they are sieging, they will take plus one attrition per month. So you will, they will take three percent attrition each month they are sieging a province of Divet and a three percent attrition every time they move from one province to another. That is terrific. You can really hammer down the their manpower in this way, in this fashion. It's really, really handy. Now, let's can try and make a claim there and we'll declare war. As soon as we can. 11th of May, so we'll do it. As soon as we can. Improve for defense. Yeah, no, no need. 50% uh, cost, so we'll go for this. Scholarling allies, Yemen would not join. Let's do this, and we'll use... Well, we might as well recruit a guy and put it there. But we'll use this one. So, Gangzu, and we'll use this one. And this one can go over there. Like so. In the meantime, we will try as well to fabricate a claim over here at Shun. Start fabricate claims around here. Stability. Do you still have that guy? No, we don't. Which is a bummer, but well. We have plus three stability, so that's great. So we'll give missionary strength 1.5% plus. That's good. Claims on arrivals. Okay. Right. Well, might as well do this one. We have a plus three stability already, so. Siege of Gangzu is over. Let's go there and then over there. Japan against Korea. Our agent was discovered in Beijing. Of course we won. Military leader has died, and it's this one, I think. Yep, we need to recruit another. Ugh. Alright, now we're talking. Theologian, let's see. Oh, damn it, it's revolt risk. I thought it was an inquisitor. I usually mistake one for another. Those two. I think the theologian will give a bonus to um, conversion and the inquisitor to revolt risk, but apparently not. Let's go there. Not sure if I want to take... Well, what the hell, let's ask for military access. They should uh, be... Uh, they should grant us. And we'll use this guy right here to siege those. Siege all of that. We'll only take these provinces around here. Siege of Suzu is done. Send this guy there then.
All right, this is going fairly well right now. Let's take off these guys there, off there though. Actually, less than them there. France has a new monarch. Six to six. God damn it. Really hate the lucky nations. Done. Let's move to Jinan. Nope. Actually, let's move all the way to Beijing. We'll siege the capital with that army. Le let's take the opportunity to take up. By the way, the reason I'm taking this up as fast as I am and not taking the ideas right now is because we still have the something along the along here. Not sure where. Right there. Technology cost minus 20% and mean technology cost minus 15 and diploma diplomatic technology cost minus 10. That's a terrific thing to have right there until 1774. So I'm going to use that and uh, until when? February. Oh, lovely. Because this will get gets us missionary strength minus three percent, and this we will need to convert a lot of provinces as soon as we as we integrate Oasis. So the liberty, equality, fraternity will finish in uh, February, and we will integrate these guys in June. So that is lovely. That is really, really lovely. In the same year, by the way. City of Beijing is done. Let's go to Jinan then. Only one more province to siege. So let's do it. Uh, let's take these guys out of there and move them around here somewhere. Good thing is we'll take all of this for ourselves. And Ming. What a white be are you crazy dude? Honestly, you want to make a white piece? They are disbanding their entire fleet. They probably are broken fin financially. They disbanded their entire fleet. Come on, fifty six percent, it's about time now. Thank you. So, 100%. We could not get full annexation out of them, but we could get these provinces around here. Like so. No release nations. Uh, transfer trade power they won't accept. Could actually take a couple more provinces from them, but no. This is good enough for me. We'll take all of that. We have a lot to core and to converge anyway, so... There. Now, overextension is dangerously high. Let's start to convert. And let's start to core. We'll start with this one, Suzu. Tibet entered the coalition and Shun entered the coalition. Daivet, Shukotai, revolted. Let's put these guys in rebel suppression as well. Because why not? And let's take these guys out of there and move them to Guangzhou. We lost the conquest and the cleansing of Eresi against Ming. The overseas expansion lingers. Shang Sungtrang has revolted. Twelve twelve eight. Crew fort defense can hire a military leader. Give to the state. Let's put into the treasury. And you by the way. Where are you going? Right, no. Stay. You. God damn it. Go over there. You. Stay there. <sighs> Take off this. Alright, 
now a revolt there. Let's use these guys and move there. Shishwan Bana revolted. Let's move over there and then send them to Tanwa. Whoa, 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 whoa. First, go there and then move to Thanglong. There we go. I need to try and make an alliance with someone. Rivals, Yemen likes this, Persia, they are threatened. Great Britain has no opinion, Castile wants to destroy us. Sweden, no opinion, Muscovy hates us, or at Ord likes us. Ugh, damn it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There is no way we'll be able to make an alliance with anyone right now. They all hate us. It's impressive. It's impressive, really. Everyone hates us right now. Poland, declare war upon Commonwealth. Tell my heir to start warring and manpower. Well, Brazil, except Brazil went and became independent. Lovely. Really? Or did they went in independent with Castile? Norway, White Peace, Brazil, Peru, Portugal is starting to lose their colonial holdings. And the USA, well the USA likes us but they won't, uh, well they actually will take an alliance from us. Lovely. This is good. Good thing they will take an alliance from us. Yeah, they want to destroy us. Commonwealth and Lithuania. Alright guys, so I'm going to put a cut in this episode right here. Uh, we will be planning our revenge against the Frenchman. Do not worry. We will plan it. We want to take that from them again. <laughs> we lost it, but we want it back. So, if you did enjoy this one, please consider giving it a thumbs up. It really helps out the channel a lot. And I'll be seeing you guys in the next one. So, until then, do take care and goodbye.